So surgery is something that you don't really want to have to entertain, but if you do, the part you've got here, Lee, is likely to be involved, isn't it? Can you explain what it is? It is. Well, this, this is what we call a fenestrated clamp. So this is typically what you'll see in a keyhole surgery type application where you've got to go inside the body and basically connect something and pull it out. Uh, and they use robots as well these days, don't they? These are actually on the end of robots. They are, so the surgeon could be sat anywhere in the world effectively operating this machine and doing an operation on you. Okay, so just to also, um, I suppose, to point out, this is the type of clamp that maybe would pick out tissues or sure. uh, parts of organs sure. and things like that. Um, what are the challenges with machining something like this, Lee? And why would you, or why do you choose, or your customers choose to use the Boomer Tech uh, 191 for it? Well, look, this is a, it's a complicated component, as you can see, and as you can see on the movie. So if I open this up, 90 degrees I, I can separate this component so the precision required within the inside form both external and internal features it's got to be a couple of microns accuracy so that the component can fit together perfectly and then you've got a number of other features such, such, as, such as teeth outside forms milling complete deburring on this component as well and this is actually two parts but they are identical aren't they even though they have made together so yeah this, this is this is two components and they, they join together 90 degrees perfect fit like i say a couple of microns accuracy and made in one hit made in one hit in, in a fully automated solution